I'm Stella Quisto here at Young and Dundas Square, and it was here at Young and Dundas Square just last year where I met a woman named Ashley. Now, Ashley was in Toronto. She's from Halifax, but was in Toronto to become a surrogate. And finally, the moment has come where she's going through the process. Now, tonight, we actually get a rare look at the process behind becoming a surrogate. I'm so excited. A lot of nerves. A lot of anticipation for Ashley Marriott lives in Prospect, Nova Scotia, but today she's in Toronto for a different reason. It's transfer day. I got my prenatals, my estrace, uh, my nedrol, and my baby's um, help with blood flow. I'm doing my needles. Um, these are my progesterone oil, so it's some hormones. Um, I have to take these daily up until um, 12 weeks of pregnancy. If I Marriott have. hasn't had difficulty conceiving in the past. She has two children of her own. Instead, this IVF procedure will be done for a gay couple from Norway. Marriott is a surrogate. Um, I just got to get my bladder checked to make sure it's full enough so that I can do the transfer. In Canada, those looking into surrogacy as an option should know it's a lengthy process. In addition to the actual procedure, there is a medical evaluation, psychological evaluation, and legal work must be done to ensure the surrogate won't want the child in the end. It's also illegal to pay someone to be a surrogate, but paying for their expenses isn't. According to the Surrogacy in Canada website, a gestational surrogate can cost more than $76,000. Nathan Chan knows how it feels to be on the other side of it all. He's a single male who wants a child. So I used a surrogate, I used multiple surrogates, multiple egg donors, and I never actually had a live birth. I was in retreat for one full year after my um, stillborn, and that made me realize that this is just such a big loss of mine, but something has to come out of this loss of mine. What can I do? Through his loss, Chan started the agency Proud Fertility to help others start a family of their own. Today, he's in Toronto with Marriott to support her through this procedure. When my children arrived, I mean, there's no words to describe that moment. And to give that to someone, I mean, I can't wait to experience what that's going to feel like. Marriott is still waiting for the results of this procedure.